welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT. Nah, nah, I might the explosive one. We're playing Town Lies. Yep. We're attempting. We're trying. So we figured out that this guy and the blonde lady are married, and they have a kid. He's talking to the sex worker girl, and we don't we, know where the, the other girl in the record store or whatever comes in yeah, yet. we don't know where she fits in. I think this is the video where he's talking to the sex worker, though. So let's see what he exactly was telling her. Yeah, because he's Prince Charming 88 or 81 or whatever. So right, he's so he's just watching he's her, watching like her sleep right now. I think. At the end of the other video, he watched them sleep. <laughs> his okay. wife and his daughter sleep for like a good fifty seconds at the end of that video. That we so watched. he he's the one with the sleep kink, because she said that some people are into me sleeping. I'm doing. I get to play my. Right. So he's just sitting there watching her sleep right, right. now. So that's where it. we can fast. Yeah, let's bookmark I'm that. Mark this. Oh yeah, dude. He's watching for a good minute. Yeah, how long until she starts? He's literally just sitting there. Could you watch him like a hot chicken laundry just sleep? <laughs> I mean, sure, why not, dude? dude? I'll tell you what. Like, I've never like been a sleep watcher, but like, th like sometimes like when I had a girl, well, would have a girlfriend, and, like I'd stay at her house and wake up in the morning, go to the bathroom, come back, and like just like her booty's like just sitting there sleeping. I'm like, man, that's a nice booty, and then you go back to sleep. Like, but it's not like I'm gonna sit there and just like stand over the bed and like watch her sleep. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, oh man, that's, I like that booty, yo. Man, this dude was watching for a minute. All right, yeah. and then he finally types something because she wakes up, right? Okay. Dude, yeah, just minutes. Excuse me. Hey, guess Why what is it not working now? There it is. Okay, no, just happy to what? Just happy to talk. Okay. So he's blowing his life savings on sex workers. I mean, we don't know if he's blowing dude. It. Talking with sex workers is not cheap. That's very true. <laughs> I've never done like a private room or anything with a sex worker, so I wouldn't know. But like, it's like, but like, even just when the, if you think about the tip tokens, you're there. Because remember when we did the interview with the sex worker? They're like, yeah, people will tip me 20 bucks just to, just to take my boobs out. And I'm like, who's paying somebody $20 to pull out their boobs? You can call me David. You can call me David. Okay. All right. So we know his name. So what did you do before? Before camming, what did you do to make money? Oh, he's very directive. Yeah, I mean, you know, he's got to be real. So this is an early... Yeah, very funny, very, very funny. So this isn't the same video that we watched her, but it's them interacting. They probably interacted I'll numerous times. I'll tip if you tell me. Okay. Fair. There's the money. Yeah, because this is almost a so This is definitely isn't the same. He just likes watching her, dude. Listening to her at this point, I guess. It's just a lot of, like, dead air. Him just, like, he's got that that, that right eyebrow, left eyebrow is out of control, by yeah. the way. Just yeah. want to put that out there. Yeah, he's literally just staring at her. So maybe the video that we have found for her under money, and maybe that's what we have to do. So, So I get it. Right. Maybe, like, if we see this video for him, we try to find the video of her talking to him. I mean, I which guess. Which could be the video that's up here right now, the next one, because it's her. <laughs> nope, it's a different length, but is this the same? Oh, we. Oh, she says money twice in this video. Now I kind of get it. She worked in a bank, made a lot of money. This is a different scene, too. Yeah. Oh yep. But God. he treated me badly, and so. I told authorities about his insider trading. I divorced him while he was in prison. But now I had no money. She brought up insider trading. Also, David's wife brought up insider trading. Did she? She did. She said, in the fantasy, remember, she was like, oh. Oh, try to take over my company. Yeah, you tried to take over my company. And I had no education, so it's a... Uh, a man's world, Davy. So, Davy. So she didn't she tell him in that video, but she's telling him here what she did before, because mm -hmm. because she was basically she was like a trophy wife, and she sent him to jail because he treated her bad. Yes, I get paid for it, and I can make men disappear like this with a butt, which is quite something. Gives you all the power, lady. 
Not all the guys are like you, Davy. Davy. Yeah, I cross my heart. Oh, look. Here it says Max. Oh no, I can't see it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Yeah, it does say Max there. Yeah, hold on. I I, I'm having real trouble reading it All right, right now. Just making sure everybody at home can see <laughs> that it says Max right there. Okay, all, all right. All right? Yeah. All right, we can keep going. That was my first boyfriend. The criminal, he did the tattoo himself. Oh, my God. It hurt a lot. Not as much as it hurt how it looks. He did not need his name on me. No. That's a they thing, though. They don't trust me. They, 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 the guys want you to tattoo their name on you, so then they feel like they own you, and then any other guy that gets with you sees that tattoo because it's forever. Yes. I feel like that type of mindset is insane to tattoo another person's name on you anyway. But yeah. it's If it ain't like your mama, <laughs> like yeah, even that's yeah. still kind of weird. Yeah. Like, yeah. you know. Like, like, I could see getting mom on you, but even says, like, what are you talking about? Like, yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, what mom? You're going to be like, mom, look what I did. You have mom on your chest. She's like, yeah. oh, that's good, honey. He makes me feel loved. Yeah, shout out to all the mothers out there. Yeah, though. exactly. Happy Mother's Day, whenever that was a while ago. Are you going to be one of my regulars? That's a presumptuous question to ask. I mean, you know, whatever. She's like, can I count on your money, David? That's really what she's saying. No. You just turn up. Tip. Big. Here's the thing, though, man. Just, <laughs> just giving money. Like a woman like this, money just to talk to you on the internet. Did you bookmark mm -hmm. this? I have not bookmarked it yet, nor did we listen to the. I mean, we don't have to listen to the whole thing. Or no, anything, but, but there might I feel be something. We'll kind of do this as we search different words. Yeah. So I'm, I am going to backtrack through this a little bit just to see if, like, you know, maybe she shows us another tattoo. Yeah, yeah. She might have one on the bottom, the you underside. What were you going to say about sex workers? You were going to say something? I don't know. You oh, just some... paying them, like. Like like when we were talking to the the ones on the podcast, well, it's like some like people will tip twenty dollars, like pull out your boobs, or like people like that guy, like she's completely dressed and he's just like tipping her. It's like I don't understand talking to a hot chick on the internet and just giving her money to talk to you. You can go to the strip club and pay five bucks to get in and get pretty hot chicks to sit there and talk to you in person and sit on your lap and stuff, rather than like paying somebody twenty dollars to sit on a screen and talk to you. If you're that lonely, I guess. Yeah, I mean, I get it. Um, yeah, yeah. You're. I don't understand. Like, I mean, if you have the money and it's like, forget it. You know, it. It's recreational. Like people would say that spending money at a strip club is is just as wasteful as. But at least you money. get touched. <laughs> at least someone's sitting on your lap or dancing I on mean, you or if something. That's important to you, I guess. I guess, yeah. <laughs> I mean, like. It's yeah. still. It's still basically just a show for. Oh your money. yeah. But you know, but you, but you know what I will say. It's like that's one thing that like strip clubs can do is like you know you're you're a guy you're like a single dude hanging out. You don't have any friends. I mean you can't hang out with your friends. And you're lonely. You can go mm -hmm. to the strip club and feel like you can be like, oh, girls like me, even though they're just but whatever. But like if you really are that lonely and need a female like accompaniment, you can go sit at a strip club and get attention from women. Or you could just go get a real girl. Yeah, or that too. Or yeah, just make course. a Bumble account. <laughs> Bumble. All right, so this chick Come is. Back. Oh yeah, it's me and Davy. Okay. All right. Nice dance. You like it? I'm wearing it all week. My oh, that's. Vampire thing. So second vampire mention. Yep. So maybe vampire he is. Our way to make rape fantasies more. Valuable. Excuse me. Which works both ways. I hey, look. I didn't say it. She said it. Wow. I am the victim. One of the vampire wives. So maybe he's taking the vampire stuff he's from her and telling you. his wife to do it in their role play because she was talking about how she's a mind vampire and now mm -hmm. she's referencing vampires again. So it's she, all, yeah, there's a lot of crossover between yeah. the fantasy that they were having and mm -hmm. the fantasies he's having. Yeah. In fact, maybe he did this you after his wife kind of. Right, or he did it with his wife after this. Told her that she's the, man, the vampire. So, all right. All right, let's keep going. Davey. Mind if I call you daddy? Oh, oh Davey. <laughs> okay. Well, now they do. So, Davey, you are the least horny law enforcement agent 
guy I have ever come He is for. really a law enforcement Cops agent. are normally the most priesthood. Oh, so he's a cop? Well, I can tell. I am good at my job. And he's more honest with her than he has been with his wife. Right, what? right. Yeah, she got Gosh. some pretty eyes, dude. Yeah, she got some some pretty stuff going on here. She has some pretty such stuff a, going yeah. on. Yeah, dude, you got pretty exciting stuff. Job. How did you end up with such an exciting job? Okay, sure, but it's deeper with you. You're nor okay, so um, we found out he's a cop. His ordinary. wife's a nurse. Isn't that like the prototypical like I'm a cop, my nervous. wife's a nurse. I bet you were young. Hmm? Okay. Okay, let's move forward slowly. <laughs> Tell me. Why are you picking your nose, lady? I'm not into that. <laughs> right? I mean, I probably am. If you do I it, probably am. If you do it centrally enough, I'm probably in. You're like, it. she's like, ooh. I mean, like, hey, you have your boobs out. You're picking your nose. I mean, that helps a lot. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me ask, let's fast forward a little bit. She's just listening. This is where Davy talks, apparently. She's just like, he's just like, oh yeah, I'm she's talking just about it. Just vibe into the convo. All right, a lot of vibe. A lot of vibing. Absolutely nothing being said. Yep, nothing at all. Just sitting there smiling, looking cute, biting her lip. What you wanted you to be this guy? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Well, I come from France. As I can tell you, French from Paris. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she likes a judge, it. Uh, powerful man. A powerful judge, man. When I was in school, I was sleeping with a guy who was a criminal. This upset my family. They were worried about a scandal, so. My father sent me to America to study. Okay. And this is where I met my husband. Uh, okay. He worked in a bank. He met. And this is where we ended okay, up. Okay, gotcha. Because that's the money. So she came to America, met her dude, got him to jail, and then she became a sex worker because he lost all his money. So. All right. So let's let's uh let's use her notes. Okay. <laughs> all right. Yeah. 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 For sure. For sure. All right, so Davey is. Seeing, a cop. Oh, See. he's he's married. Oh, Davy is a cop. Yeah, Davy right. cop. Cop. Uh, cap. But <laughs> Davy cap. Got it. Davy is a cap. <laughs> <laughs> slash slash uh, secret agent because he's not an ordinary cop. His wife also called him a secret agent. Um, Davy is also married. Okay. And uh, likes sex worker. All right. Cool. Uh, Davy's wife. We don't know her name yet. Blondie, for now, I guess. All right, blonde. She is a nurse. Yep. Uh, they both have a kid. Kid. Alba. Uh huh. And that's all we know about her. Sex worker. We don't know her name yet either. Um, she is French. <laughs> French. French. That's She's fine. French. Yep. She's French and pre uh, abused. She was abused. Abused. Um, controlling father. And uh, that's about all we okay. have. Okay. Well, right. and that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you did that, then you know there's a notification bell. We'll, we'll fill it out. Don't worry. We're, we're getting to the bottom of this. We're getting Jonas. to the nitty gritty. <laughs> TNT. We out.